Good morning, friends, and happy Tuesday. We are three days away from Disney. So excited. I cannot wait. I get so just jittery about it. Ooh. I cannot wait until I'm walking down Main Street where I can smell all the stuff that they have pushing through the air, make you so happy. I can't wait to hear the Dapper Dance. I can't wait to hear the music. I can't wait to see the little green light come on for my magic band. I am just so excited. And I know that because it's only like a Friday, Saturday, and Sunday, half a day, um, but I'm still so excited because it's Disney. It doesn't matter how long I'm there or how short I'm there. I'm just excited about it being Disney. That is all. So, as you guys can see, I have not made up my bed, and yet I am together. I am ready. Um, I was supposed to meet a young lady today at 10 o'clock uh, to buy a clock <laughs> that I am selling. And we had it all planned out as of last night. As of 10 o'clock last night, we had it all planned. We're like, okay, we're meeting at 10 o'clock tomorrow. Here's the spot. Let's go do this. And 30 minutes prior to her having to meet me, she can't meet me now. <laughs> no. <laughs> that makes me so mad. I want it out of here. And I have like 15 people in line. Next, 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 next. Who wants the clock? So I went to the next lady. I'm waiting for her response to see if she wants it. Um, it kind of just like makes me mad because seriously, I needed this clock gone. I want it gone. I'm trying to clear stuff out of my house um, because I just want all of this stuff gone. Um, and it just makes me mad. That's why I don't like selling things in those local for sale threads because I've come across this so many times. Um, and I usually put like, no, I'm not holding it. And I sometimes I feel like if I have to hold it longer than 24 hours, I'm going to charge you $5 extra. Um, if I have to bring it to you, I'm going to charge you $20 extra. Yeah, that's just the way that I feel like I need to do things. But I just, I haven't sold stuff on the for sale thread, our local for sale thread, in about a year because I just was sick and tired of dealing with people's stupidity. We set a time, we set a date, let's do it, let's get it done. I understand things come up, but come on. I mean, it's so frustrating. But anyway, so... I was actually able to film a video this morning right before because I filmed it at 9 o'clock which is 9 40 right now and then at, right after I was finished filming that video I came across her text and said um I can't make it <laughs> but anyway um so yeah I kind of screwed up my morning because I got up out of bed at 7 30 went straight to the shower got myself together and ready skipped making up my bed skipped breakfast Skip doing my morning routine because I was trying to get myself to together and ready to leave right now to go meet her. But that's not happening. So, I am going to, I don't know exactly what I'm going to go do right now. I'm starving, so I think I'm going to go grab something to eat. And then um, I was going to run to Walmart really quick. I did go to Target yesterday, but I'm going to talk about yesterday's video in a minute so let's just get going alrighty so I'm in the car all right so let me tell you what happened yesterday so I went out yesterday got a few things at Target that I needed to get went to Hobby Lobby went to Kirkland's shared all of that experience with you guys I came home I downloaded it on my computer and I set my computer down I started getting busy around the house I came back and I went to um, delete what's on my SD card that I put on my computer because I always clear it out before I take it out. And apparently my footage didn't transfer over like I thought it did. And I completely wiped out all of the footage from yesterday's vlog. So thank goodness I had my uh, Hot Topic Tuesday ready to go and that went up today. So I um, was very frustrated about that. I couldn't believe that all of that fun, good footage that I shared with you guys yesterday was gone. That makes you mad. But um, anyway, and then now it was funny. I kept thinking of that song Ironic by yeah, whatever her name is. Isn't it ironic? Da -da -da -da. Yeah. So you guys know the song I'm talking about. All right. So, um, 
I was looking through my purse, my wallet a second ago, and I knew that I had like Old Navy bucks or dollars or whatever they're called. You know, you get like the $30 or coupons or whatever. Anywho, I I knew I had like three of them, which I do. So I was looking through my um, wallet and I'm like singing that song in my head going, wouldn't it be ironic if I missed the day of the, the time of the, the dates of the, before they expire, can't, can't speak uh, before they expire and it was like yesterday oh that would have been so mad um, but now they're like they expired the 15th so yay I'm headed to Old Navy <laughs> I'm gonna go in there and see um, if I can use I have $80 worth of um, Old Navy bucks that I can use so I'm gonna go in there and see if I can use this $80 on some, I mean, I'm sure I can find something. I mean, I'm sure it could happen, it might happen. I'm just saying that it's a possibility, it could happen. So, and then I actually also put that clock in my trunk just in case the lady um, call or so messages me back and says that she can meet me, another lady, not the one that canceled on me this morning, um, it's like, because if I'm out and about, then I'm gonna, you know, I wanna meet you. And then today is supposed to be a high of 68, but um, right now I don't know what temperature it is because I have low tire pressure on my car. So I've got to go see which tire is low and get it pumped up. And uh, so yeah, but anyway, as I was saying about the weather, it's supposed to be a high of 68 today, partly cloudy, a little bit of sun, blah, 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 blah. Um, but it's like 50 something right now, like 51 out I think I just looked, and I have shorts on. I am just like, I am not messing with mother nature right now. She has got me so pissed off with this weather that I'm like, screw you, I'm wearing shorts. So I have shorts on right now, um, and then this cute little shirt that I got from Old Navy, which is not a pajama top. It looks like a pajama top, but it is not. So I'm like, I wear it. I think it's cute. It wasn't sold in the pajama section. It was in the regular clothing section. So I'm wearing it, whether it's pajamas or not. It's cute and I'm wearing it. Um, and then I just have a pair of like um, uh, greenish, army green shorts on, so cute. And I'm wearing my Adidas the new ones I got the other day. So freaking cute. I probably need to turn here, but I'm not going to because I'm going too fast and I'm afraid if I do, and I'm mm. So I'm gonna go check out this tire pressure and see what I can do. I don't think they charge for that. I know like the other place that I went to, they don't charge and um, my husband says, oh, they didn't charge you, that's great. I'm like, yeah, well, you know, I get by. So um, yeah. Uh, tire pressure, tire pressure, tire pressure. See, that freaks me out because, like, we're getting ready to go on a trip and I don't want to have low tire pressure. That I don't want to have. So, let's go get this tire fixed and then we're going to go to Old Navy. Alrighty, so my right front was a little low and they filled it up, so now I'm good to go. That was kind of like a rhyme. My right front was a little low and now I'm good to go. Uh, while I was sitting there, I got to watch, um, which I probably was there for a good 10 minutes or so because they were working on another guy first, which is fine. Um, I was actually watching The Wonder Family, which I really like watching them on YouTube. So now I'm headed to Old Navy. Let's go. Hi guys. So I am back and I did end up going into Old Navy and I just picked a Brian a couple pairs of shorts and some shirts um, Because you know, I'm always getting stuff for myself and it's just you know, he needs stuff too So um, I did pick him up a couple of pair of shorts and some shirts with my little coupon So it worked out really really well um, I also stopped at Ulta because it was right next door and I picked up a new palette Which I am so excited about this is the new, which is, it's not new. It's an old um, natural eyes palette by Too Faced. And it's the same natural palette that I've been wearing. It's just packaged different. And I love the packaging. And I'll open this up in just a second and show you guys. And then I picked up a one and a quarter salon flat iron. Um, Cause I'm trying to do my hair like in a different way. And I've seen somebody do it with a flat iron. So um, I went ahead and got a new flat iron so I can give it a try. And then let me show you guys what this, um, palette looks like so pretty okay 
so this is what it looks like. This is such pretty packaging. I love the way that this looks. It is so pretty. And it's got like a little heart on here, how you open it up. And then this is how you open it. Not with one hand though. But these are the beautiful colors that it has with it. Like I said, it's very much like the natural palette that you already have. It's just that they changed the packaging, which I absolutely love this packaging. It is so pretty. Oh my gosh, now that is one pretty packaging of um palette. Love it. Okie dokie guys. So if you guys had noticed before, like I had a little like, bench at the end of my bed. I sold that. I sold that sucker yesterday. It wasn't on that for sale thread for five minutes and it got it sold. Um, and I made uh, 50 bucks from it. So I was very happy about it. And then I turned around and ordered a new one. So my new one should be in next week. It's um it's kind of matches the bed. So I'm very, very excited about that. But I just wanted to share that with you guys. And now I got to make up the bed. So that's what I'm going to do. And the sun came out. So that makes me happy when skies are gray. Alrighty. So I've been cleaning up the kitchen, obviously taking down Easter stuff since I'm a week behind on that. But I moved some stuff around in my kitchen and I took everything off of the countertop. I've cleaned it all up. I've been using my Myers multi-surface cleaner, which I absolutely love. Um, it just makes my house smell so fresh in here. But anyway, I got this new sweet tea sign from a young lady on Etsy. I do not remember the name of the Etsy shop, but I will put it down here, right here, um, when I go to edit this video. So anyway, I have that there. Um, obviously, it's sweet tea season. I kind of pushed all of my mugs back here in the corner. I got rid of all of my Easter mugs. Um, this is just a regular Ray Dunn mug. It just says Wish on there which I love. So I left that one there and I left a few of my pink ones there for springtime. Um, I have my Ray Dunn, Be Kind one, Dreamer, and I have a couple more back there. I have this one that says T and then I have a Disney one right back there in the corner. But for now I have this up here and I moved uh, Brian's coffee pot over here just a little bit still. He can still reach his coffee, which is all up here. And then I moved this over here. I cleaned all of this counter off, it's so nice. And then over here, I wiped off all this counter as well, um, made, every <laughs> made everything nice and clean and fresh. I um, emptied out the eggs that are in here. I have to find my lemons and my limes that I put in this thing for right now. Um, and then obviously all this stuff is nice and done. I took all of that stuff off of my window as well. So I have just been uh, busy cleaning and getting all of my Easter decorations. Um, as you can see, they're all on the dining room table. I've already loaded up two totes back there of um, Easter decorations. I have to go grab my other totes, but I have a ton of Easter decor still to go. Here are all of my mugs that I have to wrap up um, and put away for storage until next year. I also wanna show you guys, I hung these up. This is kind of what I wanna leave up here like all the time um, instead of changing it out all the time, except for probably at Christmas time. But I just thought these would be so cute because it just um, you know, says spring and summer so I think I'm just going to leave these up um, on here uh, as permanent until like Christmas time when I can put my Christmas wreaths on there. So I have one over here and one here as well. So this one looks a little bit fuller and I'm really not exactly sure why because I have the same stems in each one. Four of the la uh, lamb's ear and four of like the butterfly bush stems which they're fake um and then i have four on this side too and i don't understand why they look this one looks like like it has less I'm not exactly sure why but it doesn't it all has the same and i got all of these at um all of these stems i got at hobby lobby yesterday for 50 percent off and then these i got at kirkland's um and those were nine dollars a piece so i did pretty good on those i don't know who the heck is texting me again hold please Alrighty, so it feels like my sister, my mom, it's Brian, everybody's texting me all at one time. Ooh, I got packages. Ooh, love it. Ooh, Target. What did I order from Target? Oh, those shirts. Ooh, how exciting. It's like Christmas. Let's go see what Angie got. Let's go see what Angie got. I love it. I love getting packed. Oh, I gotta take those 
I love getting packages in the mail and I love sharing them with all of you. So let's uh, get some stuff moved out of the way here and let's, let's open up and see what I got. Okay, so this is my Target bag. I know I ordered two shirts from Target the other day because I seen them on Instagram and they're so cute. I love them. I just hope that they fit. And then when I was at Target yesterday, I did not see them at all there. So I don't know if it's just like their online store, but look at how cute. You guys know how much I love stripes. So, um, and I'm hoping that these fit. Oh my God, they look like they're not going to. Oh, they're stretchy, so they might. Um, but anyway, look at this shirt. Super cute. Um, just a black and white striped sleeveless shirt with a little bit of ruffle on the side. Absolutely love it. Oh yeah, I think it's gonna be okay because it's really stretchy, so that's good. Um, it's a little short too, but thank God I wear tanks. Um, and this was $19.99. And um, I have a link to, I'll try to have a link to these below if I can find them on the Target app or Target. Yeah, whatever. And then this one. Oh, this one is so freaking cute too. This one was also $19.99. Same type of material. And I'm so glad. I mean, I got an extra, extra large because I just knew like the material. Um, but this was solid black with the little ruffle on the side of the gingham print, black and white. Oh my God. Super freaking cute shirts. So I'm gonna go through these in the wash, but look how cute that is. Love it. Yeah, I will put a link to these below if I can find them. Um, you guys can just click on the link and uh, go find them if you want them. And then my Amazon order, which I already know what this is. Um, trying to open it. This is more batteries and a charger for my camera. And these are actually already linked below. So you guys can, uh, if you need them, you can uh, link, find the link below. Sorry, I'm like get distracted. And then I also ordered what that is um, protection. These are little um, camera protectors to protect the back of this little thing that I'm looking through, which is like the little um, window. And then these are batteries. So I've um, had extra batteries because um, I wanted extra ones again because I have seven, but now I have eight, nine. Um, but anyways, and it's a double charger right here, which is nice because I can use it um, with, let's see, a USB plug. Where is it at? USB, oh, yeah, so I can use it to use, um, use it with a USB, which is really nice. Because, yeah, look at that. I can use it as a USB and plug it in and charge my batteries, which is awesome. Because, oh, I always seem to run out of batteries. So these are really nice. So I got some two new batteries and another charger, which is fantastic. And these are the same little batteries that I use for all, with my other kit, with my camera, the camera that I'm talking to you at right now. Um, because I need these for trips and vacations and all that good stuff because I seem to always run out of batteries and now I have plenty yay so now I can charge these I love this it's a dual charger perfect I'm sure that these already came kind of like pre-charged but I'm gonna go ahead and fully charge them and uh get them set up which is nice oh yeah very nice so I'm gonna show you guys how they fit right inside of here they just fit right inside of there like that. And then I'm going to go plug them in and get those charging. Awesome. Yay. Alrighty. So I put that little screen thingy on and it looks so nice. I love it. It basically is just there kind of like um, a little phone protector, like this little screen that I have on my phone. Uh, and basically that's what that is. Um, it just kind of protects the screen from getting cracked or dirty, which is very, very nice because it can come in handy, especially if you drop your camera, which I have done a couple of times. Um, but anyway, yeah, so that's going to be it for today. I'm going to go ahead and end the vlog here. It's about 2 15 and I just got to get a few things done around here. I just threw those shirts in the washing machine and I took out some clothes that were in the washing machine and I hung those up to dry and uh, I've been just kind of getting some stuff done around here. I'm trying to think of the clothes that I'm going to pack. I have to have something for, you know, driving Thursday, wake up to wear Friday, something Friday night, Saturday, Saturday night, Sunday, and coming home. So, and whatever I wear Sunday to the park, um, Sunday morning to the park is what I will wear coming home. So, 
but I do have to pack a couple of outfits, probably a nice little dress for us to go out to dinner or something. Um, but other than that, I'm going to be getting that stuff together very soon. It's probably going to be tomorrow and part of um, Thursday that I'm going to be packing. But anyway, all right, you guys, so I'll see you guys tomorrow. Thank you guys so much for watching. If you enjoyed hanging out with me today, give it a huge thumbs up. Don't forget to subscribe and I will see you guys next time on ENG Wonderland. Bye.